Bertram, you've been at many of these award show events. How do you keep Amazing Race original and, and new ideas for the show after all these years? Uh, you know, th the world is a big canvas. Uh, it gives you a lot of ideas. Once you start going around, you start looking for ideas, start writing the, the, the outline for the show, there are so many options and so many possibilities. The world is a beautiful place, a great place. And particularly now, I think it's a good idea that we bring people a little closer together instead of pushing each other away. What about working with Phil? How does he impact what you do? Well, Phil is a great host. You know, we've, we've, we, he's been with us from the very beginning, as you know. Uh, he's a great guy. He's easy to travel with and he's easy to, very easy to work with. So, And we know, of course, we know each other very, very well for so many years. So it all helps. We have a good friendship and a good working relationship. As I mentioned, you've been to a lot of these award shows. What was your big first big award show memory? Well, the first Emmy was is like nerve wracking, you know. I mean, the second one is just as nerve wracking. The third one is even. I mean, you almost don't want. You get so nervous, you don't almost don't want to go on stage. <laughs> you think you're going to pass out in front of hundreds of people. It's uh, it's very intimidating. I mean, the anticipation is so powerful, and once you have it, it's ah, oh God, amazing. Here you are at the DGA again. Good luck tonight. Yeah, thank you very much.